All right, before we go on, let me mention a few important issues that need to be borne in mind. Born in mind. To vote through the system, you need to be connected to LACNIC Assemblea. And uh, as per the uh, bylaws, only the associates have uh, um, speaking uh, uh, possibilities, so only those uh, people will be able to talk during the assembly. The questions or comments in other platforms will not be uh, taken to the microphones of the assembly during the session. We will also have a computer at the end of the room where you will be able to audit the voting. Please consider that you can only enter the system through one device. Um, so. First, I'm going to invite Oscar Robles, who will uh, test the system. Thank you. So now let's uh, select, uh, well, let's test it. But let me tell you that uh, the ID of uh, the network of the advent, we are going to disable it only for this time, for this uh, session. The uh, n uh, network of the assembly, uh, well, in, in order to ensure that you can access the voting system, we are going to remove the SSID of the network of the event. So if you are not members and you need to be connected to the internet intensively, my suggestion is either to go to a corner when you can get the SSID of the event or else go to another room. The rest of the members, of course, will be able to connect to the internet and to the network of the assembly. So let's test uh, the system. It's important for you to be connected uh, to uh, the assembly system. If anybody needs any assistance or if you need a device, if, if uh, for instance, your computer um, uh, crashed uh, just now, we can make up for it. We can give you some device. Now we are going to uh, um, test it. It's a, this is a trial voting. Let's check that everything is working. So let's start with the first voting. So the question is, if you're already logged in your device, you will see if you had to elect between uh, beer and a coffee in uh, the afternoon coffee breaks, what would you choose? And there you had have the different choices. So, as you noticed, the the voting will appear at left on this, the the left screen. It will refresh every three minutes, and and uh, on the right screen you'll see your uh, member IDs and uh, the options. Of course, this is uh, an open election as established by the uh, bylaws, as and as we've always done it. Each uh, voting has a uh, uh, limit time, and once that is completed, then we close the possibility for voting, or, or else uh, we may receive the message that uh, all the voters have already voted. All right, apparently the people request uh, to have uh, that uh, beer for the next uh, coffee break. Thank you, Oscar. Now let's welcome Alejandro Guzman, the president of the board of LACNIC, who would take the floor. Uh, sorry, I forgot to ask whether anybody had had any problems for voting. Could you please raise your hands? So let's uh, wait a couple of minutes to see what's happening. Could uh, the staff help me? Yes, please, don't worry. Don't raise your hand. Well, uh, who else? Could you raise your hands if you had any problems? There are two people there at the back. Anybody else?
Let me remind you, please remind me if there is anyone who still has issues. Only one person there. I see someone over here. Is there anyone else who needs assistance? So as soon as that is settled, please let us know and we can start. Yes? Anyone missing? Anyone still requiring assistance? All right. So I would like to thank you for your assistance. This is an assembly, and there is a protocol that requires these mechanisms, but it contains important information because this is where we do the rendering of accounts and present the reports to all the members, and we feel very proud of being able to provide this to the community. Ready? Thank you, Gerardo. Anyone else over there?
¿Estamos? ¿Seguros? So, all set. Thank you. So, it is important to state that we will now start with the ordinary session of the Assembly. We now, I now invite Alejandro Guzman, President of LACNIC's Board of Directors, to take the floor. Good afternoon, everyone. We are now going to start with the official meeting. At 16.24 of May the 4th, 2022, we opened the second call for the Ordinary Meetings Assembly of the Internet Latin American and Caribbean Internet Registry, LACNIC. According to the members' attendance record, there are 147 members present, holders of 485 votes. As a result, we have quorum, and we pass on to consider the first item in the order of business, appointing the chair and the secretary of the uh, General Assembly. Any suggestions? Microphone, please. Good afternoon. In compliance with a mission that already has quite a long time, I propose as chair of the meeting, Mr. Alejandro Guzman and Secretary of the General Assembly, Eduardo Jimenez. Thank you, Ariel. So we'll now proceed to vote this motion and open the vote registration system. If anyone is having any issues with voting, please let us know so that the staff can help you out. Raise your hand if you have any issues with voting. If you have any issues with voting, please raise your hands. The staff is around to assist you.
¿Alguien más que tenga todavía problemas con la Is anyone else having issues with voting? If anyone has any issues, please raise your hand at this moment. Muy bien, entonces pasamos a Thank you. So let us now close the voting. I'm sorry. Please wait a minute. There are some people at the back. Let's wait a second. Listo? No. Ready? Okay. So now let's see the votes. Four hundred and fifty eight. So Having concluded the votes, these are the results. In favor, 463, against 4, abstentions 17, and 11 didn't vote. All right, so after the results of the voting, then it's approved by majority, so I am designed as the president appointed as a member, and uh, Dr. Jimenez Eritanga will be the secretary. The second item in the agenda is to consider and to adopt the uh, balance, the general balance, uh, the inventory, accounts, uh, resources, and reports by external uh, auditors and the fiscal reports of the fiscal committee. Uh, for 2019, 2020, and 2021. Prior to considering the assembly of uh, the financial reports, let me present the summary of the activities of the board, and then Oscar Robles will give you a summary of the activities for 2021, and then the electoral committee will, commission will give a presentation, and then the manager of uh, finances, Diego Mena, will give the report, and Aristoteles Dantas, and an Archidiacono, and and Ibarra and Adriana Ibarra will uh, give uh, the financial data. Now, let's see the presentations. <laughs> 